day 11, and I wanted to show you guys something weird. On two different leaves, I found pistols growing out of the centers. That one, and this one. Pretty weird. I decided I'm gonna do some experimental super cropping on maybe some of these lower branches that aren't gonna produce that good of bud anyways. Um, yeah, maybe this guy. And uh, if I understand it correctly, the goal is to basically crush the interior while leaving all of the, um, the outside alive. And I, it's like the very outside layer that carries the nutrients, the whatever it takes from the water. And the inside, I think, is just for structure. So you want to basically crush the structure so this whole thing kind of tilts down. But it stays alive and it'll eventually arch back up. Uh, that's at least my understanding. So I'm going to try it and show you guys what it looks like. So I just pinched pretty hard and then folded it down. And take a look at that. Um, we'll see. Let's see. Um, I don't think I tore it at all. Day 22. I wanted to give a quick update on the super crop attempt. So apparently I did split it, but it's not dead yet. You can see it's already tilted upwards. So we'll keep monitoring it and see how that goes, but it seems like super cropping attempt number one has worked, at least so far. This is what James is looking like. Growing really tall. Uh, I can. That feels pretty hot right there. I'm probably gonna have to move out the light again. But yeah, there you go. Day 22. Hey everybody. Day 24 since switching to flower. It's starting to look pretty cool. Definitely, James is far ahead of Jim. Jim looks different. I'm not sure if it's just more disease or what, but everywhere on James, the pistols are longer. Even on these more interior, smaller ones, the pistols are longer and whiter. But James. This is the super cropping attempt. That was, looks pretty bad. So I'm not sure how that's gonna turn out, but um, it's still alive. And it's definitely tilted upwards. So I guess, so far, success. I'm gonna attempt to film through this loop because the flowers look really cool close up so we'll see how that works yeah check that out look at those trichomes this is the best flower on james really different huh James is just a different type. Like, look at it. Those little hairs. I don't think Jim has the equivalent. 
day 25 of flower here. James is starting to look pretty cool. Jim is not. I don't know what's going on. Jim is just not producing good flowers. Must be the disease. There's the uh, super crop. Not sure how well I did it. I was hoping it would heal. Focus. But looks like the end is still alive. The flowers at least. Alright everybody, it's day 30. I know it's been a while, actually five days. I was out of town um, at a music festival and um, I was supposed to get back yesterday but there was a crazy storm in Chicago which is close to where my festival was so I was stranded at the airport there. Um, didn't get back now just, till just now which is late night. Um, lights are about to go off uh, but I wanted to give you guys an update. I did ask my buddy to come in here once and raise this light to 50 to basically to where we're reading 50 on this um, this head right here. Um, 50,000 50, lux, which translates to about 700 PPFD. So I don't actually have much more room. I don't know, maybe a couple more inches, um, which sucks. Maybe I'll be able to like kind of end this guy over and tilt him up if I need to and lower him, which wouldn't be a bad idea. Oh wow, I just did that and it smelled crazy. Yeah, these guys are starting to smell. Take a look there. There's all that goodness. Quick update on the super cropping. Uh, looks like it just basically almost totally straightened itself back out again. And the wound does not look good. Um, but it is thick. So it grew itself thick again straighten itself back up so maybe I should have bent it more to enforce the true super crop um, the flower is also aiming upwards though but I think that would have happened no matter what day 31 here and I am going to do some defoliation because we're looking super dense and these two fans that I got uh, are not cutting it you can see not really getting any good airflow, so I will show you what it looks like after I am done. Done with the defoliation. Um, I got one less than a minute until the light goes off, so I would have done more, but this is what I was able to do. It looks decent. Um, I did not pluck, there's a number of branches that have pistols, or a number of leaves that have pistols coming out of them didn't pluck those just because they seem interesting to me. Like, look at this one. This one leaf. It's gonna, it looks like it's going to have a full true blood on it. So, that's cool. Uh, as usual, Jim is just so far behind. Maybe this defoliation will give Jim the energy needed to grow. James, on the other hand. Oops, let's get some focus here. Beautiful. Is really just looking great. Um, so that's the progress today. I'm pretty happy. Uh, a lot. I noticed a lot of the leaves. Let's see if I can find any. Maybe not a lot, but a number of the leaves um, were sugary on their own. So like here, you can see this one. Focus. The leaf itself started getting trichomes. Um, oh, there goes the light, so I guess that means time is up. Um, Alright, thanks a lot for watching guys. Uh, see you in the next one. Cheers.